Thank you, Dylan. Early this morning, we're off to a little bit of a cloudy start. A lot of that fog is already starting to dissipate. We're going to start to see a little bit more of that sunshine. Some cloud cover, though, mixed in along the horizon. A live look at NIU and DeKalb showing us just a little bit of that sun peeking out. Otherwise, visibility still impacted in some spots. We are under half a mile for visibility from Freeport stretching into areas like Rochelle and DeKalb, about five miles near both Rockford and even Sterling. So it really depends on where you're at. Some of us might even avoid some of that fog early on. Regardless, as it dissipates, we end up staying dry for the first half of our Monday. We'll slowly start to see a little bit of sunshine mixing in with cloud cover as we jump into those low 80s this afternoon. But that's also when we see a better chance for isolated showers and thunderstorms. Here's a future track shows us again. We're dry for the the first half of your day today. It's not until about one o'clock do we slowly start to see some of these isolated showers and storms bubbling up. Notice not everybody will see it. So on the lower end when it comes to coverage, then later tonight we continue to see that chance even through about five o'clock and then we start to dry off overnight and into your early Tuesday. Temperatures tonight do fall into the mid 60s. We'll see some partly cloudy skies, so a little bit of cloud cover sticks with us, but we still see a little sunshine early tomorrow morning. And then comes in another chance for showers and thunderstorms. So really the first half of our week features daily chances for some kind of active weather. For Tuesday, though, a little bit of a different story. That's as a cold front is going to sweep through and the coverage is going to be a little bit higher on where these thunderstorms develop. In terms of rainfall, we're going to see some areas of heavy rain and again some thunderstorms. It continues to fizzle out as it moves into the area. This is about 230 now taking you to about four o'clock and timing might still change a bit as we get closer to Tuesday. It's really going to depend on the arrival of this cold front. So taking you into the early evening hours tomorrow, we'll still see some activity and might even see some spotty showers overnight and early into your Wednesday. Temperatures are going to hang on to the low 80s through about Thursday and Friday, but that changes into the weekend by Thursday as well. We are going to lock in the sunshine. So beautiful summer weather through the end of the week for the weekend, though, we kick up the humidity and the heat. Some of us may even get awfully close to the low 90s. Lots of sunshine, though, Thursday. Thursday and beyond in your most accurate 10 day forecast. We continue to see the near 90s for next week and along with that will come chances for active weather also making a comeback heading into most of next week.